we want to simplify the given fractions. Here we have two examples of improper fractions, where an improper fraction is a fraction where the numerator is greater than or equal to the denominator. And remember that a fraction is written in lowest terms or simplified when the only common factor between the numerator and denominator is 1. So our first fraction is 72 eighths, which is not simplified because 72 and 8 do share a common factor other than 1. So if we recognize that the greatest common factor between 72 and 8 is 8, we can create an equivalent fraction that would be simplified by dividing the numerator and denominator by 8. But let's just say, for example, we only recognize the common factor of 2. We'd begin by dividing the numerator and denominator by 2. 72 divided by 2 equals 36, and 8 divided by 2 is equal to 4. This fraction is not simplified, though, because 36 and 4 still have a common factor of 4. So now we'll divide the numerator and denominator by 4. And 36 divided by 4 is equal to 9. 4 divided by 4 is equal to 1. And 9 over 1 or 9 ones, or 9 divided by 1, equals 9. So the given fraction simplifies perfectly to 9. Of course, we could simplify this much faster if we recognize that the greatest common factor between 72 and 8 is 8. So let's go ahead and show it again. If we had 72 eighths, and our first step was to divide the numerator and denominator by 8, because 8 is the greatest common factor of 72 and 8, the result will be an equivalent fraction in simplest form. 72 divided by 8 is 9. 8 divided by 8 is equal to 1. And 9 ones, or 9 divided by 1, equals 9. Another approach to simplify this would be if we recognize 8 is a factor of 72 and that a fraction bar means division, we could say 72 eighths equals 72 divided by 8, which equals 9. Whichever way we approach this, 72 eighths does simplify to 9. Next we have 33 elevenths, which is not simplified because 33 and 11 do share a common factor other than 1, they share a common factor of 11. So we can create an equivalent fraction by dividing the numerator and denominator by 11. And because 11 is the greatest common factor between 11 and 31, the result will be a simplified fraction. 33 divided by 11 equals 3. 11 divided by 11 is equal to 1. But 3 ones, or 3 divided by 1, equals 3. We could also simplify this using division. 33 elevenths equals 33 divided by 11, which equals 3. So again, there is more than one way to simplify the given improper fractions. I hope you found this helpful.